We're back again with our series and this time we're creating some mood boards in my undated planner. Erin Floto Designs and I and Archer and Olive are kind of doing a series around a whole bunch of these similar topics. So I'm going to use my undated planner here to really map out kind of like a vision board of what I'd like to see in the future. And right at the back of the month there are two um, blank bullet journal pages with a whole heap of dots on it. I'm going to use that for my mood board. So I'm going to get started with some of the really lovely blue oceany colors that I'm really excited about around the Pacific Islands. I'm going to start really simple by creating a scrapbook style feel and I'm going to go through and give it some watercolor, some embellishments, some stickers, some stamps and really just create a feeling to make it feel like my whole page is underwater. Finishing my page off with a little bit of washi tape, a couple of additional stickers and some stamps and we're ready to go. On to my mood board. Now the mood board's really cool because it's going to give you an idea around a theme and you can always check back in. So you can really create something that is suited to your style and your color palette. So once you've got this in place, you can just flip back and keep referring to it as something that you want to aim towards or achieve. So this is pretty easy. I've created a scrapbook style page again and this time I've kind of divided it up into three areas for the theme. I've created a color theme, hair and location and a whole bunch of extra additional cute embellishments around the stickers and stamps. I'm pretty excited about this page and I think it's pretty cute. I'm hoping that it really helps with our series and I'm hoping you follow us for the next one too. As always, thanks for watching and please hit the subscribe button. We'd love to hear from you in the comments below as well. Thank you.